All right, we got it trimmed back up to the scribe line. This panel here, we'll punch a bunch of holes in it and we'll weld it from the inside to that new one. all there is to it. There's a handy little tool. Blake, can you still get these? Copies. That's an old one. Yeah, this is an old one. Oldie but a goodie. But Roper Whitney. Pardon? Roper Whitney. Roper Whitney? Yeah, I think it's a uh, number five. Or is it Whitney? It's 17. It says Whitney on it, so. Whitney Metal, I think I think Roper came later. Five two. It's a five and that I think they call them five juniors now. Yeah. <clears throat> Neat little tool. Make a lot of holes in a hurry. Alright, I'll give it another test fit. Or have another test fit, one or the other. I may have a fit. If it don't fit. cleaned up. We're going to put some weld through primer on it. Caps over there. This is zinc. Weld through primer. We've got her all cleaned up. So we'll put it on it. going to do. I got to trim this flange up. And this flange along here hangs down too much. So I'm going to cut it back. We called the owner of the car, talked to him, texted him. He said go ahead. So we're going to clean this up too because it gets welded the whole length of this. So we'll get this ground down. I got a little grinding to do on this edge here. We'll get it done. Alright. I'm going to shut you down for a little while. And get that cut up. Alright, we're trimming things up. I got this one layer to do yet. 
I got the other end done. I got this lip done. So thought I'd bring it back and show you how we do it. Curves are a pain in the neck, but we got to do them. to show you who made this panel I don't know if I did or not it's not made by the same people that did the floors Let's see if I can get a picture of it hold still there Akron Ohio yeah it's not as good a reproduction as the others the holes are off a little bit but it does fit nice you gotta do a little trimming on it, but it'll be all right. All right, we got it all clamped in place. Looks pretty good. Gap's a little big on the ends, but I can adjust that as I go. We're getting there. We get the top done, and we'll do the inside. And I'll curl that around and do the bottom. Looks like the way it's got to go. It's fighting me all the way, but we got it. Cause that's what we do. Shut down for a while. You got the rough idea of what we're doing. Got that all spotted in. I'll get back to you and put you at a different angle later. We're gonna be inside the trunk doing some welding. We got all these spot welds down in through here. We got to get taken care of. And there's a lot of them. But I have the time, the man said. Do the same thing, start to center, and work our way out. Hey, right, you got the gist of that one little dot at a time. All right, I'm going to clean up these welds. And I can weld some more, but on every time you weld, even with especially with a MIG, it has a, a coating on the wire. I don't know if you can see it there or not. Yeah, you can see a little bit of it right there. And you want to get rid of that. It's usually on the ends of the weld. So when you're doing stitch welding like this, you want to. Clean up every every time you get done welding, it cools down. Go back and clean up the top of the welds, anyways, so that you get rid of that, so you don't contaminate your next weld. So that's what it looks like. Well, it's almost done. It's coming along all right. We'll work at it some more. All right, that's what it looks like done. Ground off. Now I got to go at it one more time with a DA and kind of clean it up a little more. I got a couple little spots we're going to have to go back and revisit. That's all right too. We'll get them. 
show you. Got a wall through hole right here, right here. So, I guess we'll hook up the welder and touch them. They won't take much. It's a long way down for an old man. do some spot welding now with the old spot welder and I mean old just like me and seeing how that thing is heavy I utilize the transmission jack to uh, give me a hand it's on wheels got it propped up fits right in there nice let's see what it does There it is, start to finish. A little sanding, a little plastic filler, be good to go. Alright, don't forget if you like this, hit that subscribe button and that like button. Thank you very much.